guys, this is Johnny here, and today I'm not going to be showing my face because I'm absolutely a hot mess because my hair's really bad. So, um, yeah, I was too lazy to do my hair before this video, and yeah, this is going to be me for the video. So today I'm going to be showing you the Cloverleaf Manor, and yeah, that's, that's, those are one of the amazing things I got for Christmas. Um, Merry, I guess, belated Christmas, guys, yeah, Merry belated Christmas! Oh my gosh. Um, yeah, I'm really excited. This is not going to be a brag video or anything. I just wanted to show you the awesome house that I got for Christmas. And, yeah, and the, um, furniture that is inside the house did not come with the house. Um, yeah, the house didn't really come with anything like figures or dolls or anything like that. So, yeah, I hope you enjoy the video, and let's get to it. Yay! All right, so this is the Cloverleaf hey. Manor. Hey, hey. So this is the Cloverleaf Manor that I got for Christmas, and look at this detail. I mean, it's absolutely beautiful. So let's go to the store. <laughs> I thought the door was closer. <laughs> like, the camera makes it look like it's closer. The, look at that. Like, it's just beautiful. I can't even describe how beautiful it is. And these are the plants that they came with. They came with four. They're kind of crooked, though. So they kind of. Very small packaging. Yeah. All right. So here are the windows. These open and close, just like pulling this, as you can imagine, like a normal door does. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, oh. All right. Now let's move on. All right. So this is the front doorstep where the doll walks. So up these steps, and then these really nice pillar pillars, and then they have like um kind of Greek mythology um stuff, and um. These Greek mythology things, like this is what I, that's what I think of when I see these like pillars. Um, they have a nice, a really nice um, blue door, and they have the again the plants on the both sides, and then they have the detail window above the door and on the sides. All right, um, so these also the flower beds also came with the set. They came separately, and you just have to, you know, this thing here, and then just eh, go like that. And then they swung like these. It came with two, four, six of them, so I just put them all on top, as you can see. And this house, once you close it, it's absolutely so, like, thick. It's, I can't even yeah. describe how thick it is. So... This is the layout of the house. I think the house so, looks like a church. I don't think it looks like a church. All right, so this thing up here, like the stained glass, is absolutely like so such a nice detail that they added. So yeah, let's move on. So this, all the windows on like these windows on the front of the house open, and on, do they on the sides? On the sides they don't. On the sides they don't. But like windows open. And as you can imagine, like, there's nothing to the... All right. So, as I was saying before, um, obviously there aren't any glass, like, through the window, so you could just, like, poke your finger through. You kind of have to, like, hit it hard, I guess, and then, like, just to put it back down, just hit it from the inside. Um, again, you can, like, switch these, like, take this off and put on the bottom, but I just preferred them being on the top. You know? On them on the top, no reason, no reason behind it. I just need to fix this flower bed because it's kind of annoying me. It's falling off. So let's go to the balcony on the top floor. Oh, there. All right. So it does have the balcony on the top floor, like on the roof. Um, on the top floor, I have the bunny family. I have the bunny dad, the older bunny sister. I have the mother with the bottle because she did have a baby, but I didn't move it. And the koala dad. So, um, this is what they have on top. Um, some of this you do have to assemble, by the way. So, like, these I had to put on, like, the railings. Um, these I had to add in. And then the whole thing in front, like, this, the stairs, and this, and the railings again, I had to add in. And, of course, the flower bed. So, this is the top. And I have him, like, just had some coffee and flowers and a little camera. Um, I, this, like, this, the chair, 
the table, the chair, and that chair. Didn't come with this set. Um, I got it from another Calico Critters. Um, it was from, like, I think a cruise ship or a steamboat or whatever. I will be showing you that in the next video that I do. A lot of Calico Critter videos. And I just, I don't know why they're here. <laughs> I don't know why they're there, honestly. Alright, so let's finally move on to the inside. All right, so here's the layout of the house. So they have three, six, nine floors. I mean, not nine floors, three floors and nine rooms all together. Um, have the top part, like the attic -y part, and then like, yeah, you know what I mean. You can see it. So down, well, let's start from up here. Up here, I was planning to make it like a baby's room or like a kid's room with like bunk beds and everything. Like, I'm going to get a set for that. This would be like, this for now is like a storage room stuff, but I was going to make it a playroom. This is a baby's room. Here, that I got it from My Little Pony Equestria Girls. It's not included in the set. This is also from My Little Pony Equestria Girls. The rest is not. Now, um, nothing in here is <laughs> included from My Little Pony Equestria Girls. This is not included. Here, let me just move closer. Okay. Um, so, here's the bed. And it's like, a, this is much fancier than the other one. Here, that one's just plain. Um, sorry if it's a little dark, but I tried to use like a lighting thing, but it was way too bright. And it looked kind of weird. So, inside the vanity, it did have like mirrors and stuff. This has like perfume and whatever she has in there. And under it, I have a like little flower thing that she knitted I guess <laughs> it's like I don't want to knock it over because all the pieces are small back there is like a little table next to her bed like so she could put like a clock that fell down there's a carpet her closet and um inside hold on just give me a minute so I can get the closet out all right so here's what the closet looks like outside of the house nothing in the back so, on the detail, I love the details outside of it. It's hard to open it with one hand. Inside, um, these, this, and, um, where's that mother? Uh, okay. And then this dress came with the set and the closet. This I just took off the mother because it was really old and it looked absolutely terrible. And she looks so much better now. So, let me just put it back up there. Okay. Um... But this didn't come with the set. It has a mirror inside and a, like a little like bar to hold on, I guess. A shelf down there. Nothing much can fit in here other than these two things, like the two clothing. So let me just fix this. All right. So yeah, that's the that one room. Um. Then here is the bathroom. This is like this, and this um, came separately. It didn't come with this whole setup over here. Ooh, sorry. Um, inside of this, I do have a little, um, like, little thing for you. Like, if you, the baby comes out of the bath or whatever, um, it goes up on here and, you know. Okay, and then it has, like, shampoo, a brush, like, to brush your hair, like, a brush to brush the body. And then, um, it has, like, baby lotion and whatever that is, whatever. I don't know what that is. <laughs> and, yeah. And then here's the baby tub, and it has, like, the little holder. I'm just too lazy to put all that little stuff on there, because I knew it, it would fall. So, yeah. And then here's, like, the little baby potty. I don't know. I think it's a chicken, like a little chick. Here's some toilet paper up in the ceiling. Um, I guess that's a miniature, um, sink for the baby. I don't know. I think it is. And then here's the sink for the older ones. The toothbrush did fall in. I didn't leave it in there. And then, ow! <laughs> and then here's the, um, curtain for the, um, tub. There's brush, and there's a brush for your hair, shampoo, soap, and, like, a brush for your body. And some other stuff. I have no idea what that is. And then, like, one of those old, old, um, shower things that they used to have, I guess. Um, so yeah, there's that. And then let's move on to the other side, obviously. So, um, this is, like, a much plainer room. 
It's not the best room. Um. Hmm, let's, what, where's her blanket? Oh, okay. So, here's her blanket. She was sleeping, but I guess not anymore. So let's take her out of bed. And this, like, this mattress and a pillow. And a very beautiful blanket, if I must say. It's better than my blanket. Um, oops. Let me just put that there. You can sit up or whatever you do. So she's just laying in bed. Oh, she matches the sheets. It's really cute. So the sheets are beautiful better than mine and my mom's and everyone else's in my family <laughs> and then here's the really cute lamp the flower theme still going on and then here's the drawer sorry if this is too dark i didn't know because the flashlights i feel like the flashlight is too bright see that that is too bright and freaky it just makes it look scary um here's the drawers and then this came with a shopkin um uh, shopkins this does obviously does not belong with the calico critters. Um, yeah, it's just like her school bag or whatever, like a bag for when you go somewhere. I don't know. Um, this is the closet. It did not come with any clothing. Um, the vanity again with some cookies and then a magazine ah, about picnicking. Um, here, let me just show you inside. E, e, okay. Salads and drinks. On the other page, it has cookies and sandwiches. Mm, sounds delicious. Um, let me just put it back on here. Again, these have two drawers, mirror, and it's rotatable. Yeah, and then my favorite part of the house is the kitchen. It's super cute. I am going to get another set because um, this shelf over here is from uh, My Little Pony and Crush Girls. Um... This food, too, like that, the food that's on the table is from My Little Pony and Crush Cheer Girls. That, also, the ice cream that's in the sink. Um, this um, sink over here and the cabinet is belongs to the Calico Critters cruise ship or steamboat. Also, that drink and the plates, those two glass cups, if you can even see. Um, that um, that, that uh, lemonade thing and then that bowl and the forks. And yeah, that came with the sh cruise ship. That I don't know where that I don't know where that came like what where that belongs. Um, cause they have that like for so long I don't even know. And then here's the table. The, the mom looks like yeah. And then the table c came from the Calico Critters, um, like treehouse. Yeah, that's where I put it anyway. And then um, here's like the hedgehog mom and dad. Mom, sit up, please. And then here's the hedgehog mom. She's kind of tired. Here's some fish cooking. Ooh, dark. Okay, and then, yeah, that's the kitchen. And I love it because it's, like, so detailed and pretty. Um, yeah. So that is my Calico Critters Clover Relief Mansion. So let me just show you the inside one more time. Look, I got my toes done. Finally, like, they look terrible. And my nails. Yeah, I got them done a few days ago. They're already chipping. Let me show you the front. And then here's the front. And I love this house. I totally, totally, totally recommend it if you're into calico critters. It's such a beautiful house. It's big and it's just absolutely beautiful. And I think I will show you it closed because it's such a pain in the butt to close it. Because, you know, it, it's a pain. So let's see if I can get it closed so you can see it. Well... All right, and then here is the house close, and you can just imagine how big it is. Here's the front of it closed. The slide, <laughs> not the slide, the side. This is the top. It's kind of weird because, like, this extra part is just here. Um, and in the back, it's beautiful, and um, uh, it has a lock. Um, oh my gosh, I'm falling. It has a lock. But I don't want to push anymore because something will fall. Um, but it doesn't work very well because when I tried to, like to push it, like it kept on opening. So the lock doesn't work very well. But um, other than that, the house is just amazing, and I have nothing bad to say other than that. So yeah, it's just an amazing house, and I totally recommend that you go and get it. And yeah, have a nice day or night or whatever time you are in. I don't know. Yeah, okay. Anyway, guys, bye!